Hello YouTube, welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Breezy Bree coming to you with a new Q&A video. I'm so excited for this one. Uh, we've been playing this for quite a while. We have the Slow Joe on the channel. Hello guys. Uh, we've been planning this for quite a while. We just had to have time to sit down and kind of get together. So definitely give him a warm welcome. Um, he does some Twitch and some YouTube stuff. Yeah, I do. <coughs> Sorry, got a bit of a cough. Uh, more Twitch, but hopefully get into YouTube uh, quite soon. We've still got a few things going up, so, uh, so yeah, it's, it's good. It's good, it's good. Uh, I love definitely uh, joining the Twitch streams, of course, because he's shiny hunts. And uh, it's definitely worth the time. Uh, it is so much fun. I, I, I've fallen in love with Twitch so much, having done it for the last sort of two months or so. And you've started now as well, haven't you, Breezy? Yes, I started slowly into the Twitch uh, place over there. Uh, it's a little bit harder than YouTube, I'd have to say, because you can't edit any content and you never know what's going to happen. This is so. true, this is true. She's very good, though, so definitely check her out. Uh, oh, she... thanks. Oh, no, no worries. Uh, <laughs> she's had Pokin, haven't you, going up recently? Yep, Pokin is the first one we streamed. Uh, we did some Gmod, um, and I think we did some Showdown Battles. Um, oh, nice. A couple last weekend, so yeah. this weekend we're doing some Mario Kart 8, so that'll be exciting. It'll be good. Make sure you're there, guys. Make sure you're there. I will be, hopefully. <laughs> True. We're going to try to stream a little early so we can get some, um, definitely, you know, some of the other countries so they can see it. So Team UK! Woo woo! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, do you want me to start or would you like to start? You go ahead, you go ahead. Alright, we'll do one and then one from you and then back to me, okay? Sounds good. Alright, tell my subs a little bit about your channel slash Twitch. Uh, yeah, so um, basically I'm pretty strict uh, Pokemon, basically. That's what I do, uh, Pokemon. Uh, we do uh, a lot of shiny hunting on Twitch, so that's the main thing. Um, and on YouTube we've had a few X and Y videos. Uh, we've had a few Auras and we're going to do some Sun and Moon as well, uh, looking, looking ahead to that. Uh, but yeah, all sorts of things, all Pokemon related, some TCG in there as well, I think. So, yeah, it's, it's all good, all fun, all Pokemon. Yep, definitely, if, if you want Pokemon content, definitely hop over to his channel. It's it's amazing, some of the content he puts up. Thank you. No problem. Alright, what you got for me? Okay, let's go. So, what has been your favorite project you have worked on so far on YouTube? Oh, she asked me hard questions. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's alright. Um, so I love TCG Saturdays because it definitely um, holds the views, but also I love opening Pokemon cards, looking at the art. Um, definitely one of my favorites, but my favorite so far has been the new series of Pokemon Black version. Uh, we only have two episodes out, but I've been working really hard on that one to make it the best it can be with everything uh, that goes in the moving parts of that one. So. Oh, it's probably my favorite. Gotta love a bit of editing. Yes. <coughs> okay, Alright. Your own backgrounds, of course, as well. Yeah, and that can be a pain in itself if you don't know how to do that. <laughs> Alright, what made you want to do Pokemon c content for Twitch and uh, YouTube? Um, I mean, it's, yeah, I, I guess it's what I grew up with as a kid, really. Um, what, what I played uh, the most, um, and, well, throughout adulthood as well and teenage years, it's something I really, really enjoy and something I know quite a lot about, so I think um, I bring quite a lot to the YouTube table uh, in Pokemon making uh, interesting interactive videos. Hopefully, something I, I, I enjoy a lot, so, so yeah. That's, that's a great uh, way to put it, too. I know that it's been Pokemon. I think is a part of a lot of people's lives, even those people not involved in it now. Uh, I know it was big when you know uh, Gen One and Gen Two came out, so I think that's where most people come from. It for sure, yeah. And um, as you say, uh, people who are now older, they're gonna have played it as kids as well, so they'll pass the games on to their kids, and hopefully, it will continue for many years to come. True, true. We all love Pokemon. Well, yes. Hopefully. <laughs> dear, oh dear, right. <coughs> is it my turn to go ahead? Yep, go ahead. Okay, so what is the future of your channel? And do you have any plans uh, and upcoming projects? So the future of the channel is to mainly stick to Pokemon. I have I've decided that 
with my channel I should only focus on one aspect sure. but I also don't want it to be overbearing so there is that one mix of non Pokemon related content on the channel so you'll continue to see that I think uh, since I just got my Elgato we're gonna see some more things coming to the channel that aren't things that probably most people know that I like to play so that's kind of exciting um, future projects though uh, right now we're just sticking to Pokemon Black version. Uh, we're going to finish up Life is Strange, and then I think we're going to move on to some um, either Uncharted or we're going to hop over to Fallout 4. I'm not sure which one we're going to go with yet. Sounds very good. You know, I yes. love your content, Breezy. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> um, what are some of your favorite Pokemon? My favorite Pokemon? Um, so I love Charizard. Uh, that's my favourite one, definitely, just <laughs> from childhood, and it's so unoriginal. Uh, and so oh well, that's like one of the biggest ones, right? Yeah, I mean, yeah, Charizard yeah, is definitely. a big icon. Yeah, so so I love Charizard. Uh, <coughs> then I have Slowbro, which is kind of <coughs> the mascot for my channel, <coughs> which um, means a lot to me for, for that reason, and Snorlax as well. Got a massive Snorlax plush. Yep, so, that was pretty cool. Oh uh, yeah, he's massive. He's like over six foot tall. It is pretty crazy. Uh, so, so those three, and then as well, um, Venomoth and Venonat because they were the first shinies uh, that I ever got, and they were full on shinies as well. So those as well are very, very special to me. So that's kind of cool. My favorites. <laughs> I don't think I started catching shinies until like 6th gen. No, I yeah. never got any in 1st gen or 2nd gen. It was in 6th gen that I think I got my first shiny. So. Yeah, it was so, so hard back in the day. And I, I wasn't even like looking for it. It just came up and oh, it was so special. I remember it. I remember it well. Looks like it's your turn. Yeah, well, I also had the, the favorite Pokemon. So we go with that as well for you. So my favorite Pokemon. Ugh. There's so many. No, I'm kidding. Uh, so, as most people know, I love Suicune. That's the mascot for the channel. Um, I don't know why. I just like Suicune. I think it was like... Oh, yeah, it is. And it's good competitively. And um, yeah. I like its shiny form. I like its moveset. I mean, you just can't go wrong there. Um, Pokin as I well. found... It's in Pokin. Yes. And I, I'm not very good at it in Pokin, but I'm getting there a little bit. Slower and slower. Uh -huh. Well, you, you did quite well the other night when I saw you, but that other guy with his sweet he was crazy. Yeah, he was crazy good. I was like, ooh, wow. okay, I'm done for the night. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, Gardevoir is another one of my favorites. Oh, it's um, done so much work for you in, in your competitive battling, hasn't oh, it? Oh, yes. It's worth the pickup if you're ever doing competitively. Um, it's It's got its own natural bulk. It's great for special attack. I just, the fairy typing it got just made it all so much better so i love it power. yes and um i would have to say my third favorite would be like hmm um moltres i know that's kind of an odd one it's another legend but moltres is power too but i just like it it's it's a fire bird like you think of a phoenix everything it's a sexy pokemon true true <laughs> <laughs> um but yeah so those are like my three top favorites i know like most of them are two of them are legendaries but Sometimes the legendaries are a little bit cooler than the not legendary Pokemon. So. Yeah, they put a lot of effort into the legends. Definitely. Yes, they do. And the starters as well. True. Yeah, they're very cool. Um, what is your favorite video game besides Pokemon? Besides Pokemon, so I like uh, all of the Walking Dead. <laughs> <laughs> the, the Walking Dead uh, playthroughs. Um, I've well, well, I've only got the first one at the moment uh, on my PS4, but oh my word, I've, I've loved doing that and, and still going through it. Uh, oh, it's so good, The Walking Dead, I love it so much. Yes, Telltale has a way with, uh, it's the Telltale version, right? Uh, I think so, yeah, the one with, um, the, with the black guy, I can't remember his name. Oh yeah. yeah, 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 the Telltale uh, version, they, ha they put out some good games for sure. Definitely, yeah. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> Definitely. All right, what's your next one for me? <coughs> okay, so what has been your opinion on the Pokemon community and your fan base so far? Um, so let's let's break it down into two. The Pokemon community. Sure. Um, the Pokemon community, I think, at a whole, is pretty decent. Um, I've met some really really cool people that are in um the Pokemon community, and then you have this 
the the not so shady or well the kind of shadier version of the Pokemon community, which I don't stay up with at all because no. who wants a drama in their life, <laughs> right? Yeah. Um, but I think there's some really cool people, and I think there's a lot of people that haven't been discovered yet that are amazing. Yeah. yeah. So I'm hoping that we see some smaller YouTubers come become more popular in the community for sure indeed um, yeah. just takes one little burst and then you know one video and suddenly they can become very big which which is lovely to see right right um now let's slash over to my uh fan base you guys are amazing everybody comes through for everything um definitely you guys leave your suggestions leave me comments all the time i love going through them and seeing what you guys think uh i'm a person built on feedback um, so any feedback that you guys have, I love hearing it. And I've made a lot of friends uh, through actually just my videos of them trying to talk to me. Indeed. So, yeah. I mean, it's it's, it's amazing. It's the best yep. part, isn't it? When yes, it is. Reaction. I mean, I can sit up and talk to some of my friends that I've met on YouTube for like till like two in the morning, and I'll listen to them about their real life stuff or their Pokemon stuff or their channel, whatever they need. And it's just been a great feeling, I think. Yeah, but yeah, very fun, very good. Good to make new friends and meet new people from across the world, of course. Right, exactly. Yeah. Uh, are you excited for Sun and Moon? Oh, we just got yeah. hype of a oh, new Pokemon. It's gonna be so everything. so good. That was another one I was gonna ask you, so we can sort of kill two with the with the same stone, which is good. Uh, <coughs> yeah, I've loved what I've seen so far. Um, <coughs> I think I'm going to be Team Litten, probably. Uh, uh, same team here. <laughs> uh, good choice. We're going to run with Litten, I know we are. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're Team Litten, there you go. Uh, yep. But, it, but yeah, I, I think Litten, Litten definitely looks uh, the best option from the starters. And I think I'm leaning towards Sun, just because it seems already like the, the less popular version, perhaps. Um, and also, I, I love the look of Soldier, or however you say him. He, he looks awesome as well. Oh yeah. So that's, that's me. But yeah, and um, well, there was that <coughs> new Pokemon release today as well, wasn't there? Whatever it is, that yes. lizard. I can't remember what it was called. It looks um, I need to do a video on that, but uh, did you see its uh, ability? Oh yeah, it was uh, able to poison steel types, was it? Is that yes, right? that is game breaking. That's going to be big. Now my question is, do you think it'll have an evolution because of its ability? Because I, I feel like if they do have an evolved form of it, it'll be uh, definitely Ubers. Yeah, I, I think it's going to. I think it's probably going to be a two-stage evolution. I don't know why I think that. Uh, but, but yeah, I think it will have an evolution just looking at it and its, well, weaknesses as a basic Pokemon. It probably wouldn't become competitive enough in that format. So I think it will have an evolution. But hmm. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's hard to tell right now. Yeah, indeed, indeed. Um, so, it was the same question for me, pretty much, right? Yeah, yeah, your opinions, and yeah. Go for um, the moon. Hi. I'm super excited, actually, for Sun and Moon. It'll be one of the first Pokemon games uh, of me being in the Pokemon community for it to come out, so I'm super excited to get in reviews and playthroughs for it. Um, just gotta get the capture card. It's it's almost done. It's almost ready. So hopefully we'll have it in time. Oh, it's um, so good. I know. I'm so excited. Which way? But you uh, with your capture card and all. Uh, the Kitsune one. Oh, Katsuki Kitty. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, same as me. Same as me. It's, yep. It's good when it looked it like the best one to to go for for right now. Yeah, it's it's the most integrated I think compared to Loopy's, but um, it took so long. Mine took like six months. Yeah, that's what I'm... I'm a little afraid that it might not come on time, but hopefully I'm crossing my fingers that it does. Fingers crossed. Right. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'm super excited for Sun and Moon. It, it looks like they definitely changed up some stuff. Definitely put in some of the stuff that I liked from X and Y that they didn't do for Omega Ruby and Apple Sapphire. Yeah. So I'm excited for it. And free for all. That is going to be so good. Yes, that'll be really fun. Yeah, can't wait for that one. Cool, so... Uh, what happens now? Do you, you go ahead, I guess, because I asked yep. this in a moment. So our last question, the last question for our Q and A. All right. What can we look forward to in the future from you? Uh, so basically, I've um, 
I'm one of those people that sort of can't get into something until I've got everything. But um, it's looking all good now, so <coughs> we're going to have a vlogging area. So there's going to be vlogs uh, in the future. Um, <coughs> maybe some slow Joe tries, so <coughs> I buy something uh, and, and eat something crazy like chilli sauce. I'm challenged. <laughs> Sun and Moon playthrough, uh, there'll be lots of shiny hunting, uh, Throwback Thursdays, we're going to have some retro games on like GameCube, N64, uh, stuff like Pokemon Leaf Green, all, all, all the original Pokemon games, so yeah, th there is a lot to look forward to, guys. That's exciting. It's looking... Sounds like you got your future planned out pretty far ahead. I know, I know, I, I think <laughs> I've gone a bit crazy, but, uh, but yeah, no, super excited, um, Hopefully, when I get the green screen up, everything will be good. True. So, yeah. <coughs> Alright, what's your last one for me to end this up? Oh, let's have a look. Right. Ooh, what one shall we go for? So many options. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what game was like your childhood? What game was my childhood? Yeah, when oh. you <sighs> Discounting Pokemon. Discounting Pokemon. Well, that would be my childhood, but <laughs> um, trying to think. Probably, probably Smash Brothers. Uh, definitely N sixty four. You know. Yeah. I grew up on the N sixty four, so pretty much any game Mario uh, sixty four, all those fun games on the N sixty four. So. Awesome. Yeah. Go love a bit of N sixty four ish. It's all good. Yes. I'm trying to get into the Smash Brothers for uh, the Wii, oh, but yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm terrible. <laughs> Are you bad at it? I'm hopeless. I've played it with uh, one set of friends and I was so bad. Yeah, I I mean, I'm decent with some of the characters, but I don't play it enough because I play other games. Sure. Yeah. Um, because most of my you know of my gameplay is mostly of what's on the channel. Yeah. Uh, I do play some like little games off to the side, like Ark and um. Life is strange. I play that off camera too. Sure. Um, but yeah, that's that's my childhood would probably have been Smash Brothers. Yeah. So this this was definitely uh, fun. Thanks for coming on to the channel. Uh, we definitely are looking Thanks forward. I know to what's coming for you. Sorry. Uh, we're definitely looking forward to what's coming for you. Oh, like thank what's you. coming on the channel. I totally In missed Twitch. out the outro. Sorry, guys. Collaboration coming up, maybe. Yeah. At some point. Sneak peek. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, thanks guys. Thank you.